As pilots take off, they're experts. You put the throttle to 100 and you go. They got this man. Helicopters don't put the throttle to anything, they just fall off the back end. That's right. I should actually make the helicopters launch from the front of the... Just put the, put the elevator at the front of the aircraft carrier. Secondary objective added. Sink 20 enemy ships. Okay. They're kind of in the way of the stuff I need to blow up anyway, so... You don't really need to tell me to blow them up. That's not how it works on an aircraft carrier. They use a slingshot on an aircraft carrier. I know how it works. I have a launcher on this. In fact, you can put four of them on it if you wanted to. It doesn't actually do anything as far as I'm aware. I don't think it makes them launch any faster. Enter engagement mode. There's boats over yonder. Also, there's some massive frame rate issues. But I mostly want to blow up boats. Because I don't like boats. I don't know about you guys, but I don't like these boats. They, look, they looked at me funny. There's really no reason to have those anti-ship missiles except super weapons. I mean, they do more damage, but... I don't like manually targeting things, so we'll just sit here and let them shoot itself. Shoot themselves. Ow. They appear to have broken their formation around this island, because there's two boats over there that are just... Yeah, they're just ramming into the island. They can't see the island on their own port, the fools. Cancel engagement mode. Enemy ship sunk. Secondary objective added. Enemy aircraft have been launched from the air bases. It's Enemy still quote unquote snowing though. Enemy ship in place. How are they launching aircraft? Enemy ship sunk. You told me they couldn't launch aircraft. Whatever. Stop engine. Reverse engine. Did I kill the two over there already? Mode. I guess I did. Charge them Stop backwards! Full speed ahead. There's a submarine over here. The SSS. Well, that's some creative naming. The SSS is coming for me. Submarine S. Submarine, submarine? I don't know. It's a yellow submarine. And now it's dead, so there's no more yellow submarine. Sorry, guys. I didn't mean to do it. I have a missile in commemoration. Interestingly, I can shoot these missiles at anything land as well. We all live in a yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. A yellow submarine. I am a professional singer. Professional singer. Professional singer. Spoiler, I'm not a professional singer. I can't see the shoreline. I don't know where the shoreline is. <laughs> You should have made your dock much more obvious. So we can't go in there, we go in around this corner here. Apparently we win? Apparently we win! I'm not actually done, game, but whatever. That's not a yellow submarine? Yeah, it was. It was a submarine, and it was yellow. That's how that works, man. We're gonna just go straight down the dock here. Straight down the hole. There's... Two fleets just chillaxing over here, doing whatever it is they do in their free time, I guess. I don't know what's hitting me. Oh, batteries are shooting me. It'll be alright. I'll just ram the destroyer. Thing. I like setting people on fire. Makes me happy. Probably shouldn't just sit there and tank damage with my face, but whatever. Hi guys, how's it going? I hear you have some military buildings over here. I'll ram the dock in a minute. Well, they used to have military buildings anyway. They don't anymore. I kind of feel bad for them. We win again! The frame rate over here is bad. The frame rate in most of this game is bad, but you know. There's a lot of stuff going on. It's like Dynasty Warriors, except with boats. I just took 48 damage from something there. Which is a bit unusual, quite frankly. Also some funds I want over there. 
ship sunk. Stop there we go. Full speed ahead. And I'm gonna ram the student side because Tebow. I wish I did damage doing that. Enemy ship sunk. Enemy ship they are play. Japanese, so yeah, Dynasty Wars. It's Koei. Koei made Dynasty Wars. Enemy ship sunk. It's not that they're Japanese. It's that Koei made the game. Stop engine. I like the older Dynasty Warriors as well. Be, albeit they had no story, but then again, neither does this. I like this because of the customization, and I like the older Dynasty Warriors because it's just silly. It's just a giant time-wasting game, basically. I'm on fire. Well, there's parts over there. Where did those parts come from? Sitting over here doing nothing. Ow. My ammo just exploded. It'll be alright. Secret weapon seized. Reverse Yay! Engine. And I don't think there's actually any reason to go up Mission there, complete. other than to get that now, other objective, which we'll pass on. Just blow up another airfield. That's all right. The uh, Dynasty Warriors Empires were probably the ones I enjoyed the most, but those had the problem of the AI cheats and the, you know, it wasn't really all that much of a challenge. And now the invasion is upon us at last. I think the invasion's been upon us, but whatever. Electronic targeting for you. This is stuff I've had for a while now. AS332L by one. What? Okay. I got an AS332L, guys. Why are you not excited? Yeah, that you could run in in Empires and just kill everyone on the other side by yourself. And then you would be really high level, and then that would just keep stacking and stacking, and then you would be unstoppable, because you'd be like 10 levels higher than everyone else. And it would be just kind of ridiculous. The final phase of Operation Good God My Face for the liberation of Europe is upon us. All FF fleets, otherwise known as you, will commence in advance on Kyle Harbor. Kiel? Kyle? I don't know. I don't understand why this game doesn't have more allied fleets. There are missions where there are allied fleets, and they set them up well, but, you know, they're always like, we have these massive combined operations where all of the FF fleets will be attacking. But then it's just you. Why, do, why don't you show up with, like, two allied fleets with you or something? At least that would make the missions a little bit more interesting. Hello, Dragon's Blood. Maybe one day they'll make another warship gunner, I don't know. You are the combined fleets. Oh, apparently Armored Core Verdict Day launched recently. I didn't know it launched. It has been called the closest to Chrome Hounds 2 that will probably ever exist, which makes me want to get it because how much I loved Chrome Hounds, but then I saw videos and I'm like, I don't, I don't know. It's not really Chrome Hounds any. Chrome Hounds had really slow, you know, strategic stuff. Your mechs couldn't just zoom around the battlefield, you had to actually slowly trod your way along. I liked it. And then the servers died, so it was a sad day. Fleets are now one ship. Hmm. Not sure I agree with that, but you know, I guess I'm not the commander, I don't really have a say. And this mission is really the one of the easiest ones in the game. In fact, you can do this mission with a destroyer that has no guns. Just get a destroyer, get it to go as fast as you can, and just go forward. And then curve south once you get to the top there. This is really all that happens. Total Biscuit is streaming. What is he streaming? Planetside 2 or something? 
Or is he streaming the podcast? I don't actually watch those podcasts. I dislike the format they do. There was a very there's there was a uh, Final Fantasy fourteen podcast that I listened to. That was apparently pretty good. Someone had mentioned it on the Reddit. I can't remember what the name of it was though, so I have to try and figure that out. But I quite like the the way they had it laid out. I just don't like it when you know it's fine if there's four people. It's not fine when there's four people who all want to talk simultaneously. We ought to sacrifice Terp Derp 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 Derp. He's shoutcasting Starcraft. Startcraft. Indeed. I also don't like watching him shoutcast Starcraft. I don't like watching him shoutcast Starcraft. There we go. That's the word I was looking for there. And we're just gonna keep taking this full launcher for now. It's the most effective ship we have for a while. I just don't like, I, to be honest, I just don't like watching most of Total Biscuit's stuff. Full speed ahead. All but that's just me. Anyway, attack. we need to go this way. Now, our objective is uh, to just go to the southeast, basically. Yeah, I'm not a massive fan of TV, but it's mostly due to the way that he does his content. I don't really mind him, it's just the way he does his content. Music suddenly changed. Hooray, music! Or something. I like how the submarines now have vertical launch missile systems rather than just torpedoes. Way to give away your position, dude. And then again, I already knew where you were in the details. I wonder if they have torpedoes, too. I wonder if they have anti-air, because they're actually trying to shoot down my planes. Something is, anyway. Which is obviously not good. Something has anti-air missiles. I don't approve of this situation. I know, they put a gif of, um... Whatever that cat's name is. I can't remember. The cat has its own freaking blog. Just a bunch of animated gifs of the cat doing things. I actually kind of like the gifs. The GIFs, whatever you want to call this to be there. The reason I'm sitting here, by the way, is I'm trying to shoot down any uh, missiles that go for my helicopters. We don't have a timer on this, so we can take our sweet time and do whatever we want. Pushing, that's what it is, yes. Pushing the cat. People keep saying it's a GIF. And I believe someone, at some point, said the uh, the actual proper pronunciation of it is GIF, but I'm just going to keep saying GIF. So, bollocks to you people. Push pin the cat? Not quite. There's a lot of boats around here now, suddenly. See, this is what fleets should be. None of this just me floating around. Look how many boats they have in these little formations. Admittedly, most of them are small boats, but... If I had a couple of those around for allies, it would be pretty sweet. If it were Jif, then people would eat it? No, that's Jiffy. Not Jif, Jiffy. Which is delicious, mind you. We actually, we started getting some new jelly. I don't remember from where it is, but it's called Bama. Like Alabama, but I keep calling it Obama jelly. So we've got some delicious Obama jelly in our house. It's actually really good jelly. Now that we're on the topic of jelly and peanut butter. And my hole got breached because I'm being rammed by a torpedo boat. Probably not the best idea. But I'll just tank it. That'd be right. Obama jelly, yes. Bama jelly. And full health. Hooray! That was hard. You're jelly. Look at all the boats around me. I probably don't even have to move. Sit here and keep shooting. Someone's on fire! 
I haven't lost any planes, but some of them are relatively damaged. And this is the reason I don't like carriers so much later, is because the planes aren't strong enough to do it. They don't have enough endurance to survive the, you know, anti-air missile swarm following them around. What is going on over there? That formation is broken as all heck. You guys want to sort out your formation a little bit, buddy. No, you just want to... No? no? Okay, whatever. Just do whatever you want, I guess. There's still submarines just running around over here. I haven't lost any stuff, so my helicopters are somewhere. Where, I have no idea, but they are somewhere. And I am still shooting at boats, I think. Surprisingly. Surprisingly, boats still exist. Not very many, though. It's mostly submarines left, I think. Hello. Can you shoot the little pontoon boats next to me? They're shooting torpedoes into the side of my carrier. Damage. Might be a legitimate idea, but no one is. Stop is there any stuff around me to pick up? Some funds over there. Mostly just over there, it looks like. Also, another fleet showed up. Hooray! Fleet! Also, hooray! Torpedoes! I'm stuck on this dude's boat again. I need to stop getting stuck on people's boats. Eh, whatever. Just go through the middle, it'll be alright. I think there's two fleets here. I can't really tell, but they did split up, so... We're about to just break all sorts of physics here. Actually, we've been breaking all sorts of physics, but whatever. Like this! I'm just gonna pit maneuver that battleship. It'll be alright. Didn't you know you could pit maneuver battleships? With a carrier. That's what they're for. Carriers are like the, the police car of the ocean. Enemy ship sunk. They just show Incoming up, torpedo. pull pit maneuvers. Sorry. Light damage. Enemy battleship Hello. Sunk. You wanna drop some Enemy some funds? Sunk. Mostly funds. I don't really care about parts. If you give me funds, I can get my own parts. Enemy ship sunk. Full speed ahead. That's the thing with picking up parts from boats. Enemy ship you only get one of them, and Stop, the funds are probably Enemy worth more than the sunk. part is. So, getting funds is a bit more of a priority. Also, I'm just going to go ahead and reverse. This carrier needs, like, that beeping sound. When trucks Stop reverse, it needs a beep. So people know I'm reversing, obviously. Enemy ship Can you just die? Be a lot faster. Enemy ship sunk. And my screen blacked out again. It's definitely, definitely a loose cable somewhere, I'm pretty sure. I'll sort that out eventually. That's not to say you shouldn't pick up parts, because it could be parts you haven't researched yet, but... If it's the difference between parts and funds disappearing, I would go for funds. The flan healing sound when you pick up heal boxes. For the love of God, no, because you pick Enemy up like 50 sunk. of those every second. Secondary objective complete. There's funds over there. If I didn't turn like a whale, I'd be able to get them a little bit easier. Hello. Give me your funds, thank you. Goes back to the calmer music now. Glorious. Funds back there. That raptor made an in impossible landing, considering his wing was clipping through the carrier, but whatever. That'd be right. Do you speak whale? No. I don't speak whale. That was, that was probably the uh, worst joke I've ever heard, was the speaking whale thing. I think the JU-87 would probably win. That's a pro helicopter pilot there. Considering he landed on a uh, carrier that was returning, or whatever. There is something that's way over land over here, and just out of curiosity. Secondary objective added. What is it? Is it 
cargo plane? Where is it is another question. I think it's just a random plane, because I don't see anything special here. Yeah, I think it was just a random plane that just happened to be over there. And it dropped me some glorious funds. I do enjoy things that drop me funds. I've used more than 50,000 machine gun bullets so far. We've only made it halfway through the map. The only reason I'm killing stuff is for the funds. You don't, you don't have to kill anything at all. You don't even have to shoot if you don't want to. You, sir. I'm shooting at you. Very ineffectually. There we go. Takes an unnecessarily large amount of bullets to kill these planes sometimes. And apparently I was supposed to kill three enemy air bases. I've only killed one. There's another one. Where else are planes coming from? Anything over there? No? Well, that's where planes are coming from over there, so the other airfields are over there. I guess we're only gonna get two of them. Whatever. Cancel engagement mode. I didn't want that one anyway, it'll be alright. We'll shoot that. Don't like it. That building? We don't like buildings. Military buildings. Bah. I'm basically just gonna keep going this way and finish the mission. As my computer monitor blacks out again. Should probably figure out what it is that's causing that. Let me see if the cable's loose. Hold on. The answer is no, just my monitor's blacking out randomly. The capture card's not getting a black screen, so it's not the PS2. So it's either the monitor or the output on the capture card. I don't know which. Hopefully not the capture card. Hopefully not the monitor either, because I don't really want to replace the monitor. Just saying. This is, a, this is the newer of the two monitors. The other one's like 10 years old or something. The one the game is, the one the console's running on is the only of the two monitors that I can run it on. And it's newer. It's from View, View Sonic. I don't know what kind of monitor it is, but I got it for a birthday. Mission accomplished. The monitor works fine as far as I've seen otherwise, just when I have it plugged into the PS2, so it may end up being the capture card. Which probably means I need to redo the um, firmware and stuff. Periodically I just have to reset the firmware on it. I can get 24 monitors. I can't fit 24 monitors over here. Actually, I probably could fit 24 monitors in here depending on how big they are. How many did I recover? How much did I recover is the word I meant to do? 129,000. And a 40, really, that's the reward is a 40 millimeter machine gun, something you could research by like the fourth mission. And I recovered machine guns you could research on like the second mission? Really? Hmm. Not sure I agree with your rewards game, but whatever. We will save and continue. And hope the screen blacking out does not continue. In fact, hold on actually. I'm gonna quickly pause the recording and check all of the wires. I'll be right back. 